quite often when I'm meeting with young women um, in my field of work, I love talking about the fact that if you're really um, disciplined and mindful of your money, you could have, let's say, a part-time job, you're in high school, and you're so excited to spend it because you've earned it on a Friday. But if you can start to think about, if I only put $5 away each week, the ability to have that compound at interest rates and very simple cash accounts at your local bank, the ability to start to see that grow over time. And as you educate, you can actually then make more, more types of investments, maybe when you're outside of college. And this idea about saving to keep yourself out of debt is a really important way in which you can have the most value for your money. But at the same time, you have to think about your own financial independence. And one thing that I've really learned is that women and young women, to really feel the self-responsibility for that, even if you're, in, um, as you get married and you have a life together, I think one thing I learned from my own parents and my own family is that being able to have financial independence helped us through times when my father lost his job. And that was one factor that really influenced me why I wanted to get into financial services. So I was always mindful, putting money away, keeping it set aside, but knowing that I needed to stand on my own two feet. And it kept me from maybe making some choices that were hard at the time, but I never regretted it later.